we give other people the words that we have to give them? You know, it's simple. It's just like if you have something in your life, you can give it. If you don't have it, you can't give it. Well, James chapter 5 says, uh, out of the mouth we praise God and we curse men in chapter 5 of his uh, reading in the New Testament. Abusive people give abuse. Why? Because they have abuse to give. Loving, forgiving people can give love and forgiveness because they have love and forgiveness to give. Now, uh, in the book of James, he gets into double-mindedness. Uh, we, we can do this, but then at the same time we do this, which is the opposite, and this should not be. What does God want to give us so that we can give others? Christianity's essence is not about rules that we obey or things that we do. Christianity's essence is what we receive from God. And how does God want to give to us? He gives to us through our failures in life. When things come out of our mouths, words that are inappropriate, we take those words before God, not to say, well, double down next time and do a better job. No, we take them to the cross with Christ, and there we see forgiveness. And so God takes the darkness that flows out of our mouth and replaces it with light. Filling us with light gives us love, gives us forgiveness to get outside of ourselves to give to others what we have first received from God. God is out to change lives. I want to know what you think. You know, if God has... Uh, changed you in any way, the things that come out of your mouth and have brought you from one place to another. Of course, this is a lifetime work. Uh, let me know in the comments below. If you found this video to be helpful to you, uh, you can press like, subscribe, and follow, and we'll send you more for the curious every week. If this issue about what's inside of us and what we give with words would help some of your friends on your friends list and what God wants to give us, uh, please feel free to share it and perhaps God can use uh, his grace and love in your life of your friends. But in any case, as we say, Salam Allah la paz de Dias and tu viaje. May God's peace be with you on your journey.